Breaking news, you won't believe this, but this video was created in Canva. We have huge, completely unexpected news in the Canva world. Google VO3 is in Canva. Wow, I did not know Canva could do this. Well, it's new. This is so impressive. W-O-W. -W. Introducing, create a video clip. Google VO3 comes to Canva. I can't believe I was created with a prompt. I thought I was real. <laughs> I know, I'm disappointed too. <laughs> a new feature in Canva AI powered by Google's VO3 model that lets anyone generate cinematic quality video clips with sound. All right, let's go ahead and look at the actual details. Simply generate clips with a prompt and refine them to perfection in our video editor to suit your brand or audience. Wow, this looks pretty impressive. Now, I did notice that in this video that they did select edit video after they went ahead and entered the prompt, the video was generated, and it says use in Canva editor. Okay, that's something we definitely do have to try. Now with all great news, especially good news on this magnitude, there happens to be a little bit of a catch. Now we all know that VO3 is actually quite expensive to use regardless of what platform you're using. And that is actually one thing I did notice in Canva that may just take a little wind out of my sails, but I mean, that's fine. I do know it's going to probably get better from here, but it says now it's available to our community on paid plans, including pro. And in fact, if you don't have a Canva pro plan, there's a link in my description to try it free for 30 days. I would highly recommend trying that even if you just want to try out the benefits and the awesomeness of VO3. But back over here in Canva, here is where a little wind got taken out of my sale. The initial limit is five video generations per month. Okay not ideal however it does say but we're working on expanding the availability of this feature now the only other thing is that it says it's backed by canvas shield however sometimes their moderation is a little bit too strict but we're going to go ahead and try this out in real time now in order to actually get to canva ai over here on the left hand side you can just go ahead and simply select canva ai and now this whole entire menu is going to open up now this is all you have to do. The newest thing is right here. It says create a video clip right here where I'm hovering. That is where we can make our AI videos. Now to ensure that I don't waste my credits, I do wanna make sure I do give it some good prompts. Let's go ahead and try one that I know will actually do a pretty good job. So I'm in my prompt portal database. This is the crown jewel for AI image and AI video prompts. I have specific prompts that are gonna be used specifically for VO3. So I'm gonna come in here and copy the whole entire thing just like this, okay? And now I wanna make sure that I actually had create a video clip selected. Now I'll paste in my whole entire prompt. Now check this out, we have more options below. We're gonna have style. I wonder if we can actually use these in video. Aspect ratio, okay, so we do get 16.9. Duration, eight seconds right now. Framing, we have some options for framing and now even some options for lighting. All right, let's go ahead and try that. We'll go with soft lighting, okay. I went ahead and submitted that and now the thinking process begins. Now, I'm trying this in real time with you. I specifically didn't use any of my generations up because since we only get five a month, I want to make sure I had five to show all of you together. Oh wait, but this video is done. Let's go ahead and first hit this play button. All right, so amazing prompts and AI video. This is where we're at now. Not just any prompt, prompt generators. An incredible prompt that creates more prompts. Wow, that's impressive. Now to be honest, the only reason it shows, notice there's a document that just kind of appears. Amazing prompts and AI video. I don't really know what that document is. Not just any prompt, prompt generator. However, I think probably in the prompt, it does say right here, Luna glances at a printed email lying on the desk, filled with vague descriptions. Okay, so that could just be my fault in the form of the prompt. So we're gonna go ahead and try another one before we try this prompt generator. That way we can be having one being generated again as we try out this new prompt generator in Canva AI. All right, so I'll go ahead and copy this whole entire prompt right here. Go back into Canva AI and now select create a video clip and now paste this one in. Okay, so look at this down here below at the bottom. A little bit of an issue again. It says I can't help with anything illegal, misleading, or dangerous. There is really nothing wrong with this prompt. So again, that is where the moderation sometimes can become a problem. So let's go ahead and try a completely different prompt. All right, so we'll go ahead and go with a safer one, I hope. We'll go ahead and copy this one. This is going to have more of a dialogue anyway, so it will serve as a 
really good test. Let's try this one and submit this. Okay, beautiful. Now we're gonna have two more videos we could check out. Let's go ahead and download both of these. There is that one. And now we're gonna get this one right here, which this one was actually caused by accident. So let's go ahead and check out these two. Were you created by a prompt? I think that's a, yes! Uh, yeah. Okay, wow, now those are pretty good. But now if we come back over here, and if I actually select it, with it selected because I clicked on it, what happens if I do select use Canva editor just like this? Okay, wow, now it actually does open up a timeline to where I can play it and do some editing. So what I could do, in fact, using this, I could come in here and, you know, add some elements. Okay, so I did upload a few text effects before, so I could like click on prompt right there and put this right in the middle so when he says the word prompt, it will just instantly pop up. So I can time it down here at the bottom by clicking and dragging this timeline down here below and make it seamlessly be timed the right way. Let's go ahead and hit that playback now from the very beginning. Were you created by a prompt? I think that's a yes! Uh, yeah. Wow, and then it goes away. So yeah, I mean, the power of this editing tool is gonna be pretty good that we can use. I can even add my logo in the bottom right-hand corner. That way now, if I hit that play button, Were you created by a prompt? You can see my logo appears now I, in the bottom right-hand corner. I think that's a yes! Uh, so you can even add that as like a little bit of a watermark. So there you have it, Google VO3, now available in Canva. Remember, links in my description to try Canva Pro and also try out some of these prompts. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And remember, if you like videos like this, please remember to hit that subscribe button. Until then, I'll see you next time.